Hello everyone, it's Lydia and I have a Project Share and Happy Mail. This is take two because I sounded depressed on my first take. Because, <laughs> you know, I'm not feeling well. So I figured I'd give it another shot. So I uh, altered some bottle caps and um, dominoes. I printed these really cute images last year. I found them at Jack and Cat curio.blogspot.com and I just like the vintage colors and the bunnies so I figure since it's close to Easter I might as well use them as I was um fixing stuff in my room and organizing and I came upon them so I made this one and what I did to the bottle cap was I uh, added some rub and buff to color it and I added my image and some glossy accents around the edge and then I sprinkled some gold glitter before it dried. So that's a cute little bunny and he's holding a bouquet of flowers. Then I added my o-ring and I created some bead dangles with beads and spacers and such and then I used these pretty heart-shaped charms that I received from Pamela. Thank you Pam. This one says forget me not. Really cute. I made that one. And I made this one. Again, more dangles and a different heart charm on this one. This is my dangles. These are really hard to show. So I have fun playing with my beads. And then this is the last bottle cap. Some pretty dangles and another heart charm. And I just added some seam binding here to hold them and then I altered this domino and I used um, some alcohol inks to color it and added a bale and then I had hubby drill a hole on the bottom of these so I can add my wire and I used these I think I saw this on Cynthia's video the scrappy bookworm these little earring pieces and I had thrown out a bunch and then I watched a video and I was like why did I throw those out because you can loop it right underneath in the hole on the bottom and then you just with some wires bend it so that worked out really well so I saved the um the ones that I have some of the other ones that I purchased just added some chain and some more created some more dangles I love this egg shape bead on here I have a square ronzel and some pearls and then again I added a cute little heart charm that Pam sent me and then I made this one for my daughter she's gonna wear it as a necklace that I um alcohol ink the domino bail use that earring piece on the bottom again and then the image is by graphic 45 the steampunk debutante thank you Carmen Max Nana 2012 sent me a bunch of these cute images I did these stickles all around the edge and then I added some tiny beads right here before the glossy accents dried and I used these tiny little seed beads from the Dollar Tree they're sold as nail art nail art so I sprinkled that and then on the bottom here I added teeny tiny gears that Wanda Boxy Bell hi Wanda sent me in a rack added the gears there o-ring piece of chain and then I just created a couple more dangles and I added some tiny gears these are by Tim Holtz and then another cute heart that says forget me not on there so that one's for my daughter she wants to wear it as a choker she loves um steampunk and then I got happy mail from Evie who's turquesedad hola Evie so this package came all the way from Puerto Rico and I already opened it because this is take two. So she sent me this really um, pretty altered six by six paper. She does a lot of mixed media and art journaling. So she did this with dots, so cute. I don't know why she used to um, dot these, but they came out cute. And then she signed the back, Evie. And she sent me some woven paper from DCWV and I was thinking it's going to be fun to die cut some dress forms with this really pretty texture on this so she sent me that I don't have that and she sent me a bunch of laces I think these were from Capri but I'm not sure they're so pretty she 
you sent me lots. Thank you, Webby. And then this one with the greens and the blues. This really wide pink lace. It's gorgeous. And she sent me some buttons. This one has angels on it. Super cute. And these buttons, I like these. And these, so pretty. Sent me some of these pieces, metal pieces. I don't know if she purchased them like this or if she layered them. They're really cool. And then this one. These were all in a cute little baggie. More pretty trims. I love the design on this dainty pink one. And this cream one. Love this blue one with the flowers. This is really pretty. And she sent me these cute little bird cages in gray. And some flares. These are cute shabby chic flares with cameras on them. I think it says something on it, but I'm not wearing my glasses. Spare parts. I can use these for my S flower centers. This beautiful tag. She added flowers and loads of buttons. I love buttons. These are all pink buttons. And a spray, crochet flower, metal piece, resin piece. Another flower, and that's the back of the tag. Very beautiful, Evie. And then she had altered a bag. And had it tied with some seam binding that I can use. She stamped some hearts and keys. She has a doily, those puffy hearts from the Dollar Tree. Cute little birdie. And some pearls, and she added some lace here and the large flower and some more beautiful trims and pearls very beautiful evie so that's my share for today guys thanks for watching everyone post a comment if you wish and subscribe have a fabulous day bye